Hey traders, welcome to every traders present in this video. I wish every traders to watch this video till the end because this is one of the most important video you need to know to run the automation process. Totally we are going to discuss how the automation is running and what are all the procedures you need to do once you get access with our high accuracy automated trading strategies. So once you get access you need to send the alert from trading you platform to the Tradetron platform. So I will be explaining you deeply how the procedure is going on, what are all the procedures you need to do to connect your DMAT in Tradetron platform in this video. I wish every traders to watch the video till the end, then only you can understand how the automation process is running and what are all the procedures clear cut you should uh, do to run the automation. And before watching this video, you can watch the previous videos about our automated trading strategy, then only you can know how our backtest of the strategies is running on and how the performance of the previous three high accuracy strategies we are providing right now in the same combo package. So 15 minutes time frame bank nifty strategy which is running in index as well as you can do the automation for options. This is one strategy and another strategy is three minutes bank nifty intraday strategy. So every strategies are intraday strategy and the second strategy is bank nifty three minutes strategy. So this also is running in index. So according to this, you according to this, you will be running the automation for options as well as futures. And another strategy is Nifty 5 minutes time frame strategy. So every strategy performance we have posted in the previous videos, how the backtest is going on, how the performance and how what are all the returns you will be getting according to the strategy. Totally we have discussed and what are all the max drawdown included in this strategy. We have discussed clearly in the previous videos. If you have not watched the previous videos, I wish every traders to watch the previous videos. Surely you will be understanding a good idea about the automation and what are all the automation procedures in the previous videos you can see. And now currently we are going to discuss about the total automation procedure, what are all we are going to do. Also providing the bank nifty option tips through WhatsApp. So previously according to every day, daily, daily basis we are posting the performance in our telegram channel. I wish every traders to join our telegram channel right now through the description link and uh, then only you can see the total performance of our whatsapp tips how it's going on for uh, every month you can see how, how we are providing the whatsapp tips and uh, how accuracy if, if, if after 30 days how much trades has been profited and every profits details also will be posting in our telegram channel. I wish every traders to join our telegram channel and currently we have launched a new update in our whatsapp tips. So first of all you can see the previous shorts videos we have posted about the bank nifty but uh, now you can see this video new launch so we have launched crude oil trading tips so after 5, five o'clock in the same whatsapp you will be getting crude oil tips with just triple nine rupees for 30 days so included with bank nifty options and crude oil options totally we are providing just for triple nine rupees for 30 days this package is more important so if you if you don't know any logic about trading if you don't know any strategies totally you can trust our signals in our whatsapp tips we will be providing you the entry signal stop loss target totally we will be guiding till the trailing stop loss till the market end so if you want to join us whatsapp us right now on 7200556708 so i wish now you can understand how the how accuracy we are providing the trading tips so every performance we are posting currently you can see we have also posted one of our clients automated trading strategy month end profit in our with the feedback we have posted another another shorts video you can watch this video also and currently you can also trade with the crude oil mcx with our whatsapp tips and now we are going to see the total performance of the automation procedure if you have not subscribed to our channel click on the subscribe button and click on the bell button So now I have opened Bank Nifty chart in TradingView platform. So once you open a TradingView platform with 3 minutes time frame, you can see our Bank Nifty strategy we have for 3 minutes time frame as well as 15 minutes time frame. So I will be explaining you how to open our indicator first of all. So once you click on the indicators button in TradingView, you will be getting an option called invite only script. So through our account of TradingView, we will be giving you the access for our indicator through invite only script so this is a private mode so that you could not see search our indicator but once you get access with our indicator you will be getting an invite only script mode 
so once you click on the invite only script you will be having our three strategies so these are strategies with uh, next level bot as well as Traitron. we have separate strategies so we will be giving you access for either in next level bot platform or Traitron platform so totally now we are going to see in this video about the Traitron platform connectivity so first indicator which is bank nifty jjp automated uh, money maker so this is for nifty so jjp automated money maker is for nifty strategy in nifty you will be working with five minutes time frame. this is one of the strategy the same strategy in uh, trade round and next level bot so another strategy is jjp bank nifty three minutes scalpers automated so this is next level bot and trade round here so this is what the strategy i am talking about bank nifty bank nifty in index you will be applying this strategy so once you apply this strategy you can see so this is what the performance of our strategy so our strategy you can go to the inputs settings of the strategy you will be getting in inputs you will be getting the intraday option if you want to choose the strategy for intraday or otherwise if you want to choose strategy quantity you can change it here and see the performance so total backtest it will be provided through the strategy mode of trading view so trading view is providing the backtest for almost good backtest in trading view so every trade each and every trade how much trade has been hit for target how much trade has been hit for stop loss and how much stop loss has been happened and previously according to the historical market it is providing the overview result here so you can test our strategy perfectly according to the strategy factors only we are going to implement the strategy so to implement the strategy we need to know some criteria so before fixing three minutes time frame strategy you need to know that our target is 85 points and the stop loss will be 220 is enabled so before 220 you will be getting an exit signal i have discussed about the previous videos of three minutes time frame strategy so before exiting the stop loss you will be getting a close signal so no need to worry that uh, 220 point stop loss is going to hit it's not that we have if the market is giving a fast fluctuation then only this 220 point stop loss will be a shield for your capital and you can see in, you will be getting an option for token so this token will be generated from your Traitron account to trading you you need to get a connectivity so you need to configure that this is your Traitron account so that only they have given an option uh, token in a Traitron platform so that token we need to enter here first of all i will be opening Traitron platform so this is what Traitron platform you just need to sign up with your account after sign up you just need to sign in to your account So this is what, so this is what our Traitron platform. In Traitron platform, we need to develop a strategy for you because if you are implementing for three minutes time frame strategy, then separately only one strategy you are going to run. So Bank Nifty only one strategy you are going to run. Then we need to uh, develop a separate strategy for you. So in Traitron, so this is the place which we will we need to develop a strategy. So this is what if you go with the strategy once you create a strategy separately you will be getting like this so now currently we have created a single strategy which will be taking for bank nifty so you, you can see according to our signal transfer from the trading view it will be configured here so this full coding we will be doing it for you so with your trade run account we will be doing it and you can see the strike price selection or will be held here only so once you click on once you click on the edit button you can see we need to choose nfo call option as per the first signal so this every procedure we will be doing from our side the one and only thing you need to see in trade round platform is just to how to uh, how to know the current current week expiry if you are currently working on with the weekly expiry date thursday then you need to transfer the So currently if you are working with the weekly expiry Thursday then you need to change the expiry to next week expiry because the in weekly expiry the automation is running in option decay there will be a, a big losses also if you if the, because till the evening the market is running with the decay mode so until if you are running with the current week expiry for automation then you will be facing somewhat more decay in the weekly expiry so to avoid that you can choose the current week option here from the edit I have clicked and finally you just change this 
weekly expiry to the next week expiry so whatever the next week expiry you are having if you are having the next week expiry as current month means you can choose that otherwise you just choose whatever the expiry you need so once you do this procedure then you can update this so for example i have just choose the for next week expiry then i am going just going to update this so close this so like this you will be getting a two position one is for call option and one is for put option you can click this and you can update the weekly expiry to the next week expiry and click on update button and if you want to do any make changes in your position sizing that is your lot size so currently we are running if you are running with the two lots of bank nifty you can choose here if you want to run with four lots of bank nifty you can choose here this is option directly we are choosing so two lot option our strategy need to run then i am i am just choosing two lots here so if you want to make any changes according to the position you can change it here itself and you can update it and as per the trade tron you can only use with the atm strike price so there is no option to choose the itm or other strike other strike price you can choose but the single strike price only it will be running till the market end but instead of that we can use the atm strike price so current market it will be calculating the atm strike price and according to that you can trade in trade tron platform so once you close this so these are all the simple procedures you, you should make changes if you if you are using it the weekly expiry so after the weekly expiry again you can click on the edit button and you can change it to the weekly expiry itself weekly expiry can be run from monday to the monday to wednesday in the wednesday night you just change this option to next week expiry then only the dk will be less so every every weekend every week you should make this changes and every other procedure we will be doing this full coding we will be doing for you so once you get access we will be doing this full coding finally once you done with the changes you need to click on the overall update option here so once you click on overall update option it will be updated so once the strategy is already deployed then no need to do any changes so de deploying the strategy will be done by us so if you are going with the my strategy option you will be getting an option so whatever the strategy we have created if if we have created bank nifty strategy then it will be here so if you want to deploy the strategy you you can click on here and deploy the strategy so for example you just see here i am just cancelling the previous strategy here so this strategy i am just going to delete so this is what the previously i have deployed as strategy i have deleted this strategy so if you are going to deploy this strategy again so the token from the trading view platform our indicator is asking for a token right so that token can be generated here by this strategy so once you click on the three dots here once you click on the three dots here you will be getting a api api token so api authentication token so if you if you click on this token you will be you will be getting a tab like this so once you click on proceed option so first of all it will be if they already it is generated then it will be cancelled but uh, if you have already generated it will be it will not be asking for like this so once again if you click for ap token then you can proceed then you will be getting a token here this is what the token you just need to fix alert in trading view platform from our indicator so i am just copying this token here so now i am just going back to the trading view platform and clicking on the inputs of the indicator so now i am just placing the same token here so now the token is placed and once you click on okay now that every every procedure is done so i am just going to create the alert from trading view platform so to create alert you just click on the three dots from our indicator and in, in more option so now you can choose add alert if you click on add alert option you will be getting the tab like this so this is what the tab you can add alerts so first of all change the expiry date to the final date so final date of expiry some some uh, some of them will not be having premium version so if you are choosing a open ended means the alert will not be expired till the till uh, till the lifetime this alert will be working so if you click on the open option but this will be available only for premium users so if you are not having premium option you can choose the final date which is which is the expiry date so 22 is final so i am just choosing here so once you done with this so you need to give a small syntax here in the message box instead of the previous syntax you just cancel every syntax 
so I have cancelled every every syntax and I am just typing strategy dot order dot alert under slash message so once you enter this syntax with the open braces to to open bracket and strategy dot order dot alert under slash message and closing the two brackets so if you do this procedure then only the alerts perfectly trigger options whatever signals is coming for cell entry then it will be transferring as separate signal and closing the signal it will be transferring a separate signal every procedure automatically it will be done so just just we need to create an alert as a one time so once you create this alert every procedure automatically it will be done in the automation so just i am just creating the alert here with the webhook url link so that webhook url should be connecting the strategy to the trade run platform so once you click on the notifications button you will be getting a webhook url link so once you click on the webhook url it will be enabled so this url you should paste this webhook so this is what the webhook for trade run platform if you don't know about this link if you if you want to get this link you can search in google about just search in google about trade run webhook url so if you search trade run webhook url in the first itself you will be getting the trade run webhook if you are if you can't get this webhook also you can ask with us we will be providing this webhook link so this is what the webhook link so this is what the webhook you need to transfer from trade trading view to trade run so in webhook button once you enable you, sh you should provide this webhook link then everything is perfect our strategy stop loss target everything is enabled and now the strategy is going to run perfectly according to automation so once you just create the, once you done with the every procedure in uh, alert you just create alert that's all so now you can see our alert has been created for uh, band 53 minutes scalper strategy so like this if you want to run with any other strategies you can do that procedure so according to the strategy development we will be doing you the <coughs> trade run we will be we will be developing a separate strategy for you to run for single every strategy if you are running with nifty strategy nifty again we need to develop a separate strategy for you so once you're done with this procedure just we are going to create an alert like this with the tokens we have provided everything we are we are going to just create an alert so once you're done with this you are going to deploy the strategy click on the deploy the strategy and you can see there is an option called paper trading you can also run our strategy for paper trading otherwise if you have connected your dream dmat with the trade run platform you can click on live auto okay so once you click on live auto next you you, you just need to choose your dmat here so once you click on the click on this button you will be getting the dmat so once you just choose and deploy this that's all so now I am just uh, deploying with pair button because I have not connected any of the DMAT with this account. So now I am just deploying it. So if you go to deploy, you can see the status that our strategy is active. So perfectly we have connected our strategy with the trade run platform. <coughs> so whatever alerts is coming from the trading view for our strategy 3 minutes time frame, now it will be taking directly directly in our trade run account so that in trade run we will be connecting the dmat whatever dmat we are connecting in trade run it will be directly transferring the alert in a second fraction of seconds the trade will be taken and perfectly the execution will be happening simultaneously so this is how you need to do and every day morning you just need to log into the dmat from trade run platform so you just to connect your dmat you can click on the profile and you will be having a broker and exchange so once you click on this this is what the option you will be getting so if you click on the add broker option click on the add broker option you will be getting an option called to select broker so if you click on the select broker for example i am just clicking a 5 paisa so for 5 paisa it's open apa once you click on this everything is every details it's done for uh, other demands you will be getting uh, they will be asking a separate api details so if you want want to get the api details also you can uh, we will be providing with the videos according to how to get the api details of your dmat we will be providing with the details totally so total procedure just to add the dmat here 
then only the traitron will be connected with the dmat so now i am just saving it so now our dmat is connected here as per the api so to log in for this dmat they have they have done with this so for 5 paisa it, this is the simple procedure if you are copying this link you can daily log in to the dmat separately so you just click on that link then you can see here the client id and password is asking so once you done with this daily morning login then direct execution will be happening for the automation strategy so totally we have discussed how the automation is running and how to connect our dmat totally we have discussed in this video i wish every traders have understood about how to connect your dmat and how to fix the alert for trading you totally according to our bank nifty strategy and nifty strategy totally so same procedure for every strategy you need to do if you are working with 15 minutes time frame strategy the same procedure and if you are working with other strategies you can do the same procedure and one and only thing another another one thing i have missed is if you are if you have if you are running the strategy in in live market if you in the deployed session if you are getting any error that it is showing an error execution if if any if any dmat issue if the fund is not there if any issue with the dmat means it will be showing you the error error execution option here so that it will be protecting you the next alerts should not be taken in the dmat if you are getting this type of errors in live market you can click on the three dots here you can click on the three dots here you can so you will be getting a reactivate button here so right now the strategy is activate so it will, it is not showing that button so once if the if the, if you are getting any error execution in live market you can click on the reactivated button reactivate button here otherwise if you could not do the reactivate another one thing you can do you can go to the deployed option and you can just delete the deployed strategy and again you can click on the my strategy option and again you can deploy the strategy so this is what other procedure to currently execute the strategy if you are getting any error execution the next trade will be stopped so to avoid to avoid that you can delete the previous strategy and again again you can deploy it that's all that's all right now the perfectly the strategy is in active mode so every signal from our trading you it will be transferred to the dmat perfectly through traitron platform i we have we have seen the full automation procedure how the automation is running from the trading you to traitron from this video surely thank you traders thanks for watching this video till the end i will be meeting you in the next video with the automation procedure how to do with the next level platform next level bot platform so next level bot is also a good platform we have connected for automation whatever dmat you have according to that we will be saying you to configure with the traitron or next level bot you can do accordingly so a simple procedure i have explained you in live market if you are facing any issues according to error execution you can easily solve this by doing this procedures and if you are a new to fix automation you can watch this video again and again you can easily fix the alert and every trade procedure automatically it will be taken to the dmat thank you traders thanks for watching